Excellent. What makes this so great is that you can multitask. You can saute, you can fry, you can simmer, you can braise. It's portable too. You're just going to plug it in. Great for the camper, great for the tailgating teams. Take it anywhere. And what's so nice about it is nothing sticks. You don't have to add any added butter or oil or anything else. And it's under your total control because you have manual temperature controls on it. It's Copper Chef. They're the hottest thing going right now because nothing sticks and everything cooks up beautifully. Today for 24 hours on QVC2, our big deal price is two easy payments of $17.49. This is brand new. You can only get it here at QVC. It's exclusive to QVC and this will ship out to you March 7th. So you do have to kind of reserve yours and we make them just for you. But what you get is the fabulous skillet itself all with that really, really popular Copper Chef um, finish on it that's all non-stick. This measures 18 inches in length, 12 inches long, a six and a quarter inches high, and that is with the lid because you do get the lid with it too. So you get the electric skillet, you get the lid, and right there, as I promised, the temperature control. We're going to go over to Eric Thies because if you thought that an electric skillet is just for breakfast in the morning, just for eggs, just for bacon, just for sausage, you're wrong. We're going to cook up lots of things. We're going to keep things warm for everyone that kind of rolls in at a different time and so much more. Ah! Eric, <laughs> how are you? I miss you? This smells so amazing. You have at Sweet. least three inch thick fillets yeah. on here cooking up. These these are bigger than my fist. Yeah. These are big fillets. They're eight giant ounces. Now this thing is so big. We've never done this before at Copper Chef. So it's really exciting. Because what we did is we took our Copper Chef ceramic tech coating mm -hmm. and our aluminum core that spreads the heat really well that everybody's fallen in love with. And we put an electronic plate on the bottom of it, which means you can just plug it in, guys. And let me show you this. Okay. So this is what we're using. You don't need to use this on the stove oh, top anymore. So good. We have an electric panel for you. Now, this is gonna give you total control. See that? Oh my gosh. Everything yeah. from low all mm. the way up to 425. So you can sear, braise, wok, make eggs, take it out to the barbecue, do your corn, your uh, mm. beans. Everything. 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 By the way, yeah. um, we are opening up our phone lines, so we'd love you to share your story. 1 800 600 1556. I'm going to switch with beautiful. you, Eric, so that Look way that. you can kind of um, work down the line a little bit better. Yeah. Um, by the way, yeah. we're streaming live on QVC2 on your on the Facebook page. So if you have questions for Eric or myself, give us a call. Um, give or talk to us on QVC's yes, Facebook yeah. page and we'll check in with you in a little bit. That is gorgeous. Look at that searing in that juice of those steaks. I know. So you know what 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 is really wonderful about this is no matter where I put the steak on this electric skillet, it got the same sear. Yeah. Now, why is that important? Because you don't want to have to have hot spots and cold spots. Right. You don't want to have to worry about flipping the steaks from the center to the middle like you have to do sometimes. I can't stand that. So also now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to add some wine oh and you're going to see all gosh. the little bits and pieces of that steak. Ooh. Oh, that's going to bubble up. Oh, that's We're going to let that reduce a little bit. And then I just want to introduce you to our lid. Okay. It's a big, beautiful Copper Chef lid. It takes up the whole place. It's heavy and secure. <sighs> and these handles stay cool to the touch. Okay. So you can take, you can make and take. You want to make it in the kitchen and then put it on the uh, dining room table. Yeah. It's going to be great For to do me, that. For me, what I love about this, let's open that up. Look yeah. at that. You guys, I wish this yeah, was smell-o-vision. Um, and look at these cooking up beautifully. What I love about this is a lot of times I don't like to get my big oven cranked up, you know, just for a couple things. The other thing that I like is that my family is on different schedules. So I like to be able to cook everything up. Everyone who's home comes and gets something to eat. Whoever's not home, I can take this temperature down to low and just kind of keep this warm for whenever anyone's coming over. And I'm Italian. 
So there's parties, <laughs> there's get-togethers, and there's lots of family members. So it's always nice to have that extra cooking surface, to have that little something extra on the buffet yes. that I can serve out to everyone, keep it warm. Right. You know what? Whether it's steaks, whether it's corn, whether it's lasagna, Ooh. whether it's sausage, whether it's an apple crumble. Sausage, come on. Sausage. <laughs> Ooh, sauteed onions and mushrooms, my yeah. favorite. So what we did here is I, I wanted to kind of show diversity. Now, I don't know if the camera people can do this for me, but often you guys only see what I'm doing one at a time. Right. If you could take a look down this way and then that way, <laughs> guys, I'm telling you, I have about 30 of these going. Go in. And I'm going to show you so much stuff, you're going to be like, how could I have never had yeah. an electric skillet before? Exactly. That, oh, there they go. Look Thanks, team. You're then, awesome. You guys are great. And then look at down there. But there's another whole set of three tables on the other side of the studio. You know what? You're so right, Eric, because so many times people think an electric skillet. I'll make those flapjacks. I'll make those yeah, eggs and right. bacon. <laughs> guys, open your mind. Broaden your horizons. There is look so much that you can do with this that is so beautiful. For me also, I love one pot cooking. I love to put everything in one thing. I'll do chicken, peppers, potatoes, onions, one pot, turn it on, walk away, and it's perfect. Ooh, you know what? Yeah, little onions, peppers, and mm. eggs, one of my favorite things in the whole world. Oh, my gosh. Now, now look at this. Look, I just want to show you the copper chef here. Okay. Because we are browning these onions like crazy. Now, look at my ceramic tech coating. And for those of you who have copper chef, look at this. This is like wow. brand new. It's like I never even cooked on it yeah, before. Yeah, yeah. Look at that. So I could go right back in and start cooking again. So I have my Copper Chef pan that like I this. love. Do you, are you telling me that this kind of works just like that one that I already have that I use oh, on my stovetop? No question about it because think about it. So what we did, all we did was we replaced your stovetop. We replaced your stovetop with an electric coil. Wow. That's now underneath. So look, I'm going to unplug this guy. All right. And I just want to show you, you can use it like a regular pan. Oh, All we're doing so is we're good. making it electric. Oh, we got to get some of that deliciousness. Look, look at this. Don't guys. burn your stuff there. No, I'm good. Oh, uh, look at how perfectly these are cooked. Oh, my word. Look at that. And look, that everything's just rolling right out. Oh, yeah. This is. How easy is that to clean? Look at this. Just come here. I'm going to go like right down the center. Okay. Look at this. Oh, my gosh. Now, look at the stripe down the center. Okay. And now I'll make an X out of it so you okay. can see. I want you to see how dirty it is. Yeah. So look at this. Even this burnt part right here? Come on. What about that? Oh, dear. I mean, this isn't even a wet cloth, guys. And oh, my look. gosh. Look at that. Now, it's clean. I seared those steaks live. I did them right as Antonella started. Yeah. Cooked them, plated them, cleaned it up. Now yeah. I'm ready to go down. Look. Actually, let's just stay here eight for one minutes. second. That was done in eight minutes. If I want to go, I can just go right down oh. with my pork chops because oh it's my clean. Gosh. Now, let me tell you something about the shape. It's really, really big. It's nine by 15. Oh, and these are huge These are pork huge chops. pork chops. Um, I think six David likes to call those pork sickles. Yeah. Because they have a stick on them, which oh, makes me laugh. Oh, my gosh. Now, we're just going to get these going here. Now, I unplugged this, but I could literally start cooking again. All right. So, just right off the top, we seared, we roasted our beautiful fillets. I cleaned out the pan. Sauteed. Sauteed onions and mushrooms. Then I started cooking my pork chops. Okay, and that was done in nine minutes. Uh, we're gonna go to the phones real quick. Okay. Linda, you are live on the air. This is Eric, I'm Antoinella, how are you? I'm doing just fine this evening. I hope y'all are too. We are. Hi. I wish you could smell this. It's, it's amazing how quickly Eric made such a beautiful meal. I uh, already know how wonderful the meals are made with uh, the Copper Chef. Oh, oh, tell me about it, Linda. What do you know? Well, I don't have this one, but I've got his the handle pot. Be right. And my daughter and my son, they have fallen in love with them. I've gotten all of them. I will be getting four of these tonight because they do everything. I love it. I love four of them. She's four of four them. Of them. Yeah, I'm gonna, yes, I can't get one just for me. My kids, they have to have them. Yeah. <laughs> well, Linda, now you've got me thinking because for the price, I'm thinking if I do four, two, when the family comes over, I could do one with lasagna, one with the steaks, one with the chicken, one with the potatoes, and just have like a whole buffet. The, uh, the uh, pans that come with the steamers in them, you'll, yeah. never, you'll never get roast 
get your lobster steamed or you steamed. Oh, oh, Linda, I like Nice. You. I like so, that too, Linda. So this is the only piece I don't have at this time, but I will be having it coming to me. Awesome. You, you know what's nice about them. this, Linda? It's going to work just like the ones that you have. The only difference is you can kind of do it anywhere you want. In the dining room, in the kitchen, outside, in yeah. the back. Yeah, camping, yeah. boating, yeah, that's, that's, yeah, sure. anything. That's, that's going to make it nice. Yeah. Nice. Well, thanks so for all, calling, Linda. So we all appreciate of my kids it. will be getting one. That's how nice it is when Mama gets one. The kids. You're a sweetheart. Kids. That is so thoughtful. Well, what a nice mom. Moms are the best, item, aren't they? And I, and I stand behind it 100. percent Oh, thank now you, that, Linda. That means thank more to me than gold. Thank you. Or thank copper. you. Thanks yeah. a lot. Thank you, Linda. Have it. a good night. Bye bye. Bye bye. Um, so that's awesome. Oh. I. I <laughs> That's how I get. That's okay. How I, I want your attention now, please. Okay. I didn't know that's how you roll in the kitchen. <laughs> what are you doing here, corn? We're doing some corn. All right. Because the summer, guys, I, for those of you here on the East Coast with me who are tortured by the weather, it's yes. coming. I know it's coming. We're going to get out to the grill soon enough. Look, look how I'm doing my corn. Mm. So think about this out by your grill oh, on a nice sunny day. Yes. Look how it bubbles evenly all the way around from side to side. Oh Again, this is nine by 15. This is big. It's over four quarts in capacity mm -hmm. if you were to use liquid measure. But now, think uh, about this. How many ears is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Just to give you Easy. guys an idea. My alternative, what I would have to do, Eric, is I'd have to take a big pasta pot, fill it with water, try yep. to get it boiling, and jam all those in there, and I wouldn't be able to get 10 ears of corn in there. Look at how beautifully this does it. All right, so let me show you an easy way to butter your corn. What? Take a piece of bread, yeah. spread some butter on it, Yeah. then you <gasps> take the corn oh my and put it in the bread because now the bread is sort of your um, pot glove, you know, your hot oh mitt. Oh my gosh, I love then this. Then you just spin the, but the, bread, the uh, corn just like this, Yeah. and it's buttered just like that. <laughs> and then, to make it fun, I always like to put a little Parmesan cheese on it. Oh my gosh! And then we also put some, oh, mm. we put some herbs on it. And then if you want to, you could put some cayenne pepper. And then what you have is a street corn. They call it dirty corn. And it's dirty because it looks dirty, but it tastes so good. Okay. So there's just a little trick. It's an easy way I to love butter it. your corn. We have you a question for you, hand. babe. We've got a question. Yeah. Ja uh, Janie? On Facebook, remember we are streaming live on QVC 2s Facebook. She wants to know: Is the skillet immersible? Good question. Okay. No. So what you want to do is, again, because it's Copper Chef, you can fill it up with water in the sink, no problem. That's what I do when I clean. Disconnect it. the plug first. Yeah. Take the plug out, of course, guys, and then fill it up with water. Because look, I have water in here now. Yeah. Hot, soapy water. Wipe it right out. You're ready to go again. Like it. I could even fill that with water and get it up to the highest temp. Sure. And, and let it, it like sit, this. bubble it like that, just like that, and Absolutely. that would clean it better than a dishwasher would. Yeah. I would. mean, you guys, you guys saw what I did over there. I seared the heck out of those steaks. I wiped it out with a dry cloth. Wow, that's beautiful. All right. So now we're gonna have a little fun. Okay. <laughs> I always thought we were having fun. That was pretty <laughs> well, awesome. This is more fun because it, it has dessert. Oh, All right, we, ha we had some dinner, we had some corn, good conversation, okay. some wine. Yeah. Now it's time to make dessert. I'm going to show you the easiest dessert in the world. Okay. So what I did is I took some uh, cinnamon buns, you know, the kind that you pop? Yes. Pop, right? Yes. And then I cut them up. I just okay. cut them into little pieces, and now I'm just going to pop them into the copper this chef. This is just what you got at the grocery store in that roll. Yeah. Okay. No, it's in a roll. Okay. And you don't have to do anything because these are going to expand. So then you just smash them down. Okay. Just like this, I'm telling you. Be that sloppy. You're kidding me. No. Okay. Then we're going to take some apple pie mix. Oh, jeez. We put the apple pie mix down. Okay. Just spread it around. Remember, everything is going to expand, so you don't have to worry about being perfect. You're just throwing it in. Which is why, this is the way I like to bake, because I'm not a food scientist. Yeah. I'm not a big fancy baker, guys. I'm raisins? not. Raisins? You got raisins? Raisins okay. and then butterscotch morsels. No, you are Maybe you could put some nuts. You're okay. going to put the top on. Set it to 275, and then come over here, All right. and let me show you uh, the best, easiest dessert you're ever going to make. <gasps> Look at this. This is oh. what happens. Oh, now okay. Think about that. We made this in an electric skillet, right? Oh, my gosh. Would you Wouldn't ever Wouldn't you think love that at those tailgating parties, um, the big game, any... Br Look oh, at look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, Seriously, my. Seriously, guys. Gosh. Now, look inside that pan. Don't, don't go. I know you want to look at the food. But look, I'm going to take another piece out here. Okay. Look at that. Ay, ay, ay. This is literally like it was It's sliding of the box. off. It's, yeah. Look at that. 
Oh, I no, have to. I know you did. I do. I can't. Don't even. You don't even I have to say can't. Anything. What are you doing uh, now to is, me? Oh. oh, sure. Go all the way. <laughs> I mean, if you're going to go, you got to go deep. You're going to go. You're going to go all the way. <laughs> oh, my God. Well, do you have a uh, spoon yeah, or should I just I have a spoon. lick it? Where's my spoon? <laughs> oh, no. Where is it? Oh, wait. Somebody right here, here, oh, here, here, here. I have them all over okay, the place. Okay, I got it. Go. I got it. Right here, Steve. These are good. Yeah. You guys. This, I can't believe you made this in a skillet. In an electric skillet. It's like moist and soft and juicy and yummy. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Look at this.